Students in Fairport using YouTube, Fairport using YouTube in hopes of getting a new playground. Plus, she stumbled on a romantic proposal at Letcher State Park, and now she's got something of a mystery on her hands. Matt Malloy has it all from the digital desk. Hey, guys, we're going to start with PETA. The animal rights group is suing on behalf of that guy, that monkey right there. The monkey took this now famous selfie after a nature photographer positioned the camera. PETA says the monkey should be declared the copyright owner of the photo rather than the photographer. They want proceeds from the photo to benefit the monkey and others living in that reserve. I'm not making up this story. The photographer says he's actually very saddened by the lawsuit because he considers himself an advocate of animal rights, but that monkey did in fact take that photo himself. All right, some Fairport kids taking to social media for a good cause, all in an effort to get a new playground. Students at Brooks Hill Elementary School in Fairport raising money to replace their current playground. It's about 20 years old and has a lot of wear and tear. They created a GoFundMe page to raise money and a YouTube video to explain why. Check this out. Our playground definitely needs some help. It's worn out and some equipment is even broken. We need a new playground. Wow, the playground is a very fun and important place at Brooks Hill School. It sure is. A new playground will make Brooks Hill an even better place for all the kids who come here. Pretty cool. So they're trying to raise about $50,000, about half what it takes in order to build that new playground. You see right there, they've got about 1,400 so far. If you go to the digital desk on 13wham.com, you can find a link to the GoFundMe page to help out. Hey, finally, a woman stumbling upon that right there at Letchworth State Park, a special moment witnessing a couple getting engaged. Carrie Elizabeth actually snapped photos of the two. She captured the moment right after. You could see the couple embracing and sharing a kiss. She got their phone number because she wanted to send them the pictures. Turns out though, it was the wrong number. Uh -huh. Now she's trying to track down the couple <laughs> so that she can give them those pictures. She shared it on the Letchworth State Park Lovers Facebook page. The only thing that she knows about oh. the couple at this point is that they're from Arondacoit. Okay. That so it's kind it of a distance. Yeah. You can't yeah. really see that up close, but uh, she's hoping to track down that couple and give them those pictures of their be, special moment. you'll be the missing link That would be cool if we could pull it all together. You're going to be the mat. No, the matchmaker already happened. Okay. <laughs> but if, if, do they know when, did, they, did you say when the picture was taken? Was it, it, it was in the last week. Okay. All right. She posted the pictures, I think, a day or two after um, she setting. visited Letchworth and okay. saw that little proposal there. So. Very nice. All right. All right. Well, we want an update, Matt. I will right. continue to follow it. We'll see if they connect. <laughs>